The World of School was founded in 2000 with 40 learners. It has since grown to around 300 learners. Among the learners, 73% come from a disadvantaged background and close to 56% of the students are below the median in terms of school fee payment. We asked the new U.S. ambassador to Namibia if he thinks the program is working. This is the first time I've had a chance to see something that, that PEPAR has been doing with students here in Namibia. And I think the important thing to remember about HIV AIDS prevention is that it's about communication. And the great thing was seeing these, these 10th grade kids communicating openly about issues that I think they otherwise probably wouldn't feel comfortable to talk about. And that, I think we're hopeful that that will be a life-changing experience for them. So I, I think PEPFAR is doing great work here. With this new initiative with the school, the learners will be doing a musical and confidence building project. We're here today because the PEPFAR program has invested 25,000 US dollars into the Waldorf School to be able to do prevention and treatment messaging here at the school with the high school students. So we're pro funding a program that used to be called Hit the Beat. Some of your listeners may be familiar with it. And it's a musical and confidence building project that the school has had in, in existence in the past. And PEPFAR is now uh, funding an HIV component to the program. So the high school students will be here learning from Lifeline Childline, which is funded through USAID and PEPFAR. And they'll be learning about how to protect themselves, how to make si safe choices, and how to prevent the spread of HIV and AIDS. The project aims to spread the message of HIV and AIDS and will enable learners to be involved in a creative program.